Hey, good morning everybody and welcome to the Glade Creek Grist Mill. We're at Babcock State Park in southern West Virginia. What an absolutely stunning scene this is. I have watched video after video about this place and it just didn't do it justice and I'm sure my video is not going to do it justice either. It's getting lighter out so I want to concentrate on taking these photos so I don't want to vlog too much. So I'm going to get the photos, put those up on the screen for you and then we're going to go on a hike throughout uh, Babcock State Park. So I'll be back with you in a little while when we go on our hikes. I hope you enjoy these photos. We can't believe we're actually here. All right, so let me explain my shot a little bit here. So I was up closer to the mill earlier, shooting with my 16 to 35 millimeter, but I was getting too much of the sky and we really don't have that much sky interest. So I've moved back a little bit. I put on my 70 to 300 millimeter and it's a much better scene from back here. And I'm gonna shoot both portrait and landscape orientation from back here. Um, and I'm able to cut out the sky. Like I said, there's not much going on in the sky except some haze from those wildfires. I might end up focus stacking this because I do have a rock right here in my foreground that maybe is a little bit blurry. But yeah, I'm running a really long exposure right now, so I'm in bulb mode. Uh, using my Sony remote control timer and I'm about 150 second exposure right now. Some people like, you know, one second, half second, quarter second shots on their waterfall. I like to really streak it out and just make it as misty as possible. Yeah, 150 seconds, so I'll put that up on the screen for you if it turns out, and uh, wow, I'm just so stunned to be here. This is amazing. Dream come true. Virginia. I don't have much to say other than I have some observational notes for those of you who follow photographers around, like you're their assistant. You end up spending a lot of time either sitting in one place <laughs> with nothing to do or moving too fast to enjoy what you're seeing. So for example, yesterday we were in the clouds, it what felt like forever. I ended up actually just sitting there reading a book because <laughs> there was nothing to see except fog. So that was nice though, I got to sit there and read my book. Today, we are in this beautiful place. Check it out. How gorgeous is that? That waterfall, there's an old mill in the background. It's just absolutely beautiful. And I'm just sitting here enjoying, listening to the waterfall and relaxing and thinking and just not ready to move or anything. So I'm gonna enjoy it as long as I can because I know Mr. Photographer there is ready to move on soon <clears throat> and go take more pictures. So I'm gonna enjoy this view for as long as I can before we end up hiking <laughs> and moving on to our next location.
All right, so I've changed positions. I'm really close to the mill right now. So I put my 16 to 35 millimeter back on, trying to get the rapids uh, flowing down here, plus the mill, plus the bridge up there. It's just a great scene. Both of my tripods are precariously perched here. Uh, one wrong move and both of the cameras are going into the river. So <laughs> let's cross our fingers and hope that doesn't happen. So just an absolutely stunning scene. So many different compositions. If I can get out onto these rocks, I'm gonna try to get up onto these big boulders behind me here and see what kind of shot from there. And then maybe back, there's a road back there and maybe see if I can get a long distance shot from, from farther away with my 70 to 300 millimeter. Just, I know I'm babbling. It's, I'm just so excited to be here. This is a dream come true. I've always wanted to photograph this place and here I am and I just can't believe I'm actually here. So I'm running a really long exposure again. I'm, I am getting some of the sky in this one, so I'm not sure how this one's going to turn out, but it looks like a fantastic scene. Yeah, I don't really care what the sky looks like. This is just absolutely amazing. So, all right, let's see how this looks. Uh, not too bad at all. The sky actually maybe has a little bit of definition in it that I can bring out in Lightroom. So, let's see that again. Yeah, I'm definitely happy with that. So before we move on to our next location, and while we still have this place to ourselves, I wanted to show you this amazing part of wherever we are. Um, it reminds me of like a scene in the Harry Potter films. I feel like I'm on location <laughs> in a Harry Potter scene. Just watch, I'm gonna show you, you'll see what I mean. I feel like I am at one of the like, little pubs or something in Diagon Alley. It's really cool. I just had to show you before people start showing up. <laughs> All right, so I think I found my last composition. So we moved all the way back down this road here. And now I got the full scene in here. Um, I put on my 70 to 300 millimeter. I'm doing long exposures from back here. I have a 10 stop ND filter on and I'm doing about 50 to 60 second exposures right now. Really trying to smooth out the water, still the waterfall. Um, don't have very much movement in the trees. So I'm not really concerned about that, but what an absolute dream come true to be here finally and to get to see this beautiful scene and the opportunity to photograph it. I hope my photos do it justice because there's so many great ones from this area. The only thing I can think of being better than this would be being here in the autumn or even right after a fresh snowfall, but this is beautiful and I'll take it all day long. All right, so I think we're gonna wrap it up today from Babcock State Park. Joanna and I are gonna go do some hiking here and uh, just enjoy the day and then probably go back to the Airbnb tonight and make some dinner and uh, watch some Netflix or something. Uh, yeah, so thanks guys for tuning in today. If you're new to my channel and you enjoyed what you saw today, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. And to any new subscribers that I've had here in the last month or so, welcome aboard. Glad to have you along for the weekly landscape photography adventures. I hope you enjoy what you're seeing. And there'll be several more vlogs from here in the great state of wild and wonderful West Virginia. Yeehaw, country roads take me home. 
All right, you guys, have a great day, and we'll see you again from somewhere here in West Virginia. Thanks, guys. Bye. We're dumb. All right. Good dance. Use that in the blooper reel. We dumb. <laughs>